Mm -hmm. SLR. Now, what are you thankful for? So you put, I am thankful for, now what? Put Chris. She put mom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, thank you, baby. I don't know how to read it. Do you want to put Chris on it too? I see. You can put Chris down here. You can put and Chris. Can you put and? You want to put and? Yep, I know how to spell it. Okay. Are you thankful for Chris though? You sure? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Are you sure? <laughs> you want to put Chris and Mia? Mm. Are you sure there's going to be space up here? How about we do it we'll, here? We'll see. Huh? Okay, here we go. Okay. No, that's D, Chris. I know. C, capital C. Okay. H, R, I, S. Say put Chris. You can put Mia over here. So it'll be Mommy, Mia, and Chris. So Mia. So over here. Yep, there you go. Capital M. Whenever you start someone's name, always capital I, Y, A. There you go. So now when you read it, it says, Ava, I am thankful for Mommy, Mia, and Chris. <laughs> is that what you want? Yeah. This is cute. There you go. And then it looks like this. She's a thankful turkey. She <laughs> thought I said, I am a turkey. <laughs> I am a turkey. Okay, sound it out. Right under the N. Yeah. T. Ah. Mm. What? N. 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 That's how you do thankful. So thank and full. That's full. Yeah. Like you're full, like you're hungry and you're full. Oh, well, yeah. If you spell full, it's two L's if you're hungry. But at the end of thank, it's just one L. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? So if your tummy's full, it's F-U-L-L. -L. Can you try your hat on? Let's see. I'm pretending I'm Captain Charlie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ew. Ew. what? It's tea. It's green tea. Green tea? Oh, yeah. It's brown. It's called green tea. It, it's not actually green. <laughs> it's made of leaves that are called green I tea don't leaves. See. They're not in there either, honey. <laughs> <laughs> it's it so literally. So we picked up Ava from school already today. I was filming all day this morning i slept a lot too he let me sleep for a long time a really long time mm. and then i filmed here's a picture after me filming so i'm not always bummed out i sometimes look put together but uh then i take it all off hair included and here i am um so yeah i filmed and i'm gonna be editing right now there's like other pictures from the day too like this one but I want to show you the more important pictures because those are not important at all. Mia's school had a like surprise photo shoot that none of us knew about, and now that she wears uniforms, like I'm surprised they didn't tell us about it because we would have, you know, obviously sent clothes in for her. Cause, you know, it's picture day, you put in a certain outfit or whatever the heck. But these are so cute. Of course, I had to spend freaking money buying the CD for the usage of the pictures. I swear they do this like four times a year. That's like expensive. Usually the CD is sixty dollars, but the CD was a hundred dollars this time, and I was like. You know, you have to weigh, like, saving money in pictures that you might never get again. So I was like, Ugh, okay, I got the pictures. I always get the pictures. I always do. But anyway. And they also threw in the portfolio, which is all the printed pictures they had of all the poses. Why am I keep going out of focus anymore? I freaking fogged up my camera, probably. The um, pictures were good, though. They were good pictures, right? Yeah, so Chris was in the car with the kids. I ran in to get the pictures. And I, don't, I thought they were just really good poses, like... The cost for one pose was ridiculous, so buying the CD made the most sense, but then they threw in the portfolio that had all the printed, they're downstairs, but I'll show you guys at how cute these photos are. These look how cute. Uh, I think she did a great job um, posing. Look, look at that pose with a hand. 
that one's gonna come in a snow globe because they give you a free snow globe and they recommend like close-up pictures so we did that and my favorite two are these bottom two that one is so adorable that needs to be printed love the head tilt on that one i feel like she looks a lot like me there but it's just a great pose where her baby hairs aren't acting a fool let's say i got some snapchats of ava as i was picking her up from escuela <laughs> Oh, she got friends. She got friends. I like bowling. Morning. It is Saturday morning right now. I'm sure you guys something that's kind of disastrous. My recording area. Disastrous. I filmed yesterday, I believe. Yeah, yesterday. Um, I don't remember if I vlogged or not, but uh, a lot of breath walking up and down the steps. Over and over, townhouse problems. The kids are here today. Uh, we just finished cleaning their room. I mean, the cleaning crew was here like a week ago, but of course they destroy things. It's okay. You can just make it again. Yeah, you can get So Mia's eating some cereal. What's it called? Captain Crunch. Captain Crunch. Oh, okay, your mouth's full right now. And she's playing tea party. Ava is. Playing Play-Doh and she promises not, oh, tea party. Here we go, here we go. You promise not to get that on the floor, right? Oh, I'm like pointing all incorrectly. Um, yeah? Auntie Angelina will be here in a little bit, okay? Like I said, keep your room clean. I don't want all that little bits. Try to keep all the little bits together. Like, in the center of the table so they don't fall off. I moved their table away from the wall because it kept hitting the wall because it's a little shaky on the carpet, just a little bit. Um, so when they would move at all, it would bang against the wall loudly. So now I had to scoot them this way. But it works. And they promised not to get stuff everywhere. The only good part about having it against the wall was that like stuff didn't fall through the crevices, but now we have a, a four angle craziness. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. <laughs> so yeah, their bed's still made. The cleaning crew makes it like they tuck it in, like thinking they sleep this way, but they like to sleep this way. It always looks like that because we have a mixed match of sheets and stuff like that. And you know, when pillow cases get dirty, we wash those a lot. And then they've sheets underneath. These are just blankets tucked in. So yeah, their bed's always gonna look a little crazy because they want to sleep together until they want to sleep apart. But um. Books are back in, blah, 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 blah. They're watching Vamberina. Just put that on right now. So they have a hamper right there, which, you know, they sometimes use. Mm-hmm, sometimes. Uh, and then I, these are their pictures from, you know, past Mother's Day, which I've showed you guys before, but I told them, like, this is why Mia will always sit on this side, and Ava will always sit on this side. It depends on which way you're looking. If you're looking at me, yes, you're on the left side. If I'm looking at you, you're on the right side right now. That's how that works. Mm -hmm. They have a calendar here where we X off the days. Hey, we gotta X off one more day. And then it... You like the sprinkles? Oh, they're stars. Yeah, they're little stars. I got this at Target and I just rip off every month and I just hung it with a little hook thing and we can bring it. Hey, don't move it when Ava's writing though because I don't want you to write on the wall. That's the dangerous part, but Ava likes to X out the days. And then we highlighted, you know, what colors they're at what house, which is incorrect right now. Can you get the orange highlighter, baby? Orange? Yeah. Can you go, no, can you get me the orange highlighter from my office? Yeah. Sure, you can X tomorrow, okay? I will tell Ava. Don't worry. Okay. Thank you. Because originally I gave their dad... Hold on. Ava, can you pull the cap off? Can you open this for me? Cap? Yes. Thank you. So originally I gave their dad this weekend because he asked for it. So I gave him my weekend, but I'm taking it back because uh, he didn't need it anymore. So he gave it back. Um, yep. So we... No, so mom's orange. Mommy's orange, baby. Yeah. And Mommy's daddy orange. Daddy is yellow. Yeah, daddy's yellow. And pink is the, um, Can you the close way. it? Yep. 
So usually I have every Mommy Wednesday and Thursday, but Thanksgiving Mommy. is his in custody because he asked for that. And Christmas is mine. Mommy. And then we do every other weekend. This just helps the keep them on track on what day it is. When you, 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 when you cross it out, yes, you are right. So we just have these little highlighting sharpies. And Mia wants to do tomorrow, so let it, Mia X out tomorrow, okay? Thank you. Hey, girl. How are you? We usually stack our empty boxes behind the couch and they pile up because only one day a week do they take recycling so it like stacks up like crazy. But luckily, that was uh, two days ago. I have some clothes that I need to organize. But otherwise, I mean, the house has been pretty clean. Got my cake topper chilling. Um, I mean, it's as clean as it gets, I guess. <laughs> but let me open this box for this one. Can you sit there? Thank you. So, Yuna's blocking everything right now. My friend Angelina's coming over today. She's one of my bridesmaids, one of my best friends. Uh, she's coming over to hang with the girls and stuff. And also, she's going to a wedding across the street from us, so I'm gonna be doing her makeup. I don't really freelance anymore or anything like that, so that's just like a disclaimer for anyone who was uh, considering emailing me for that. Thank you, and thank you for your interest, but I don't feel like anymore. I'm done doing wedding parties. I used to just do it only for friends and families, but I'm just totally done. I'm only doing Angelina's makeup today. It's just uh, really stressful trying to like keep the kit replenished, because I didn't really you know, do a lot, so I didn't want to do too much. This is so ghetto. Chewy has never done this. Chewy usually is so good about it. Now I just have a bunch of packaging envelopes I can just reuse, because they use this stuff their stuff like the heck of dog food that has a scoop stupid overpriced bin but we like it because it keeps the countertop like it just fits on the countertop well we don't have to have any extra storage aside from the bag which we store in her cabinet that whole little single cabinet right there is hers so recently we switched her to the adult formula of her dry food so she uses blue wilderness and she was on her puppy food you know through her puppy years she had no problem with it it was like a beef rocky mountain recipe she loved it um and then i figured i would just switch it up for her as we switched to the dog uh, to the adult food you know to a different flavor because they have like chicken salmon and beef and she's been having uh, her beef with salmon oil on top. Now she's just bougie, as me and Chris say. And she just has to have her salmon oil on top of her dry food. Because now she's she's eating it right now, but she doesn't gobble it up or show as much interest to her food. Sometimes she'll just leave half of it there compared to before she would always finish her food when she has her salmon oil. The salmon oil is really good for her hair and uh, keeps her skin nice and her hair glossy. And before she had salmon oil, she had like itchy issues. So um, now she doesn't, which is also a good thing but she also didn't need the salmon oil to keep her from itching right now and that now she just doesn't want to eat her food so she has about half a bin left of salmon right now and i'm gonna mix in um her chicken formula because we got her chicken this time to see if she prefers that um otherwise we'll just put her back to beef she's not allergic to anything it seems it's just her being picky you know some dogs are picky and i got her some dentist sticks to try hey sit down Thank you. I'll give you one of these so you leave me alone. Ah, ah, ah. They're all like stuck together. This is salmon oil she likes to use or we like to use for. She doesn't really care. This is wild Alaskan salmon oil skin support for dogs and cats. And it has omega 3s, fatty acids made in the US. It's pretty affordable and it's like just like a squeeze tube of fish oil. So she likes that on top of her food. We also get these like six packs of bully sticks for her.
Chris is gonna be like, why didn't you wait till I got home? And I'll be like, I'm a strong, independent woman that don't need no man. While he's picking up food. <laughs> You in a bad booty. Raindrop. Drop top. So I have this teal mask on and a teal headband, which I'm so excited about because this is my favorite mask from my My Face Tori box, which is right here from this month. If you guys haven't even gotten it yet, get it before the end of the month because the masks in it this month are really good. I love the purple packaging one. It's like a three-step purple one. It's like the softest mask I've used in a long time. And this one fits so well and looks so cool and it's not slimy and dripping or anything like that. It's, it's a two-piece but really nice. Yes? We can, I cannot hear the TV. Okay. So damn annoying. <laughs> So we're at the salon right now, and I'm gonna give you guys a little, little short little time lapse because we're gonna just hit my roots. Let's see you. They rooty. They is rooty. Not in the, my fake root way, my fake roots right here. This is this is a real root. So we're gonna handle that before Thanksgiving. Um, and Chris is gonna get a haircut too, but he ran to Ulta to make some of my returns for me before his haircut. And um, you can see Lynn's right there. My station's right behind Lynn. I don't think I've ever shown you guys the new BC Studios. So, it looks like that now. Has a, that's the shampoo station. And then that's the front desk. And then the color bar is over there. Look how pretty. It's huge now. Super huge. But yeah, I'm not sure if the music will get me copyrighted, so I'm going to time lapse you guys if you don't mind. Hello. 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 Oh, we're not back. Oh, my butt. Ow. That hurt. My chiropractor kicked my butt yesterday, guys. Like, so hard that my arm's sore, my neck's really sore, and my butt's sore because my leg's been acting up and it connects all the way to your booty. But I want to show you guys a finished hello before the battery dies. And he got his hair cut too, so he got a little finished hello. And we are gonna head home now and possibly go grocery shopping. So see you guys in the next scene, honey. Can I get a hand, please? Hello, people. We are currently prepping for pre-Thanksgiving dinner. Is that what we're gonna call it? The day before Thanksgiving dinner? Yeah. Yeah, so got my spices, making my marinade, trying to get some good, there it is, good lighting. Um, and I just got my hand, I wash my hands again. So <laughs> I can marinate my chicken overnight. 
and yeah it is on and popping chris is cutting his stuff for his guac aka kelly's guac recipe but yeah so we're just prepping it's a prep we took her to the dog park as well it's a yuna no no don't lick it has a water which trims the time of the down. My baby's famous spicy Thai chicken. It's not Thai! <laughs> So it is about 1.30 right now. I'm going downstairs to put the chicken in thy oven. It has been preheated. I sent Chris downstairs to preheat the oven at one o'clock. I'm about, it's actually 1.16 right now, not too bad. So I'm about 15, 16 minutes behind, um, but I finished my video, yay. Got to pop these chickens in and then start, you know, you know. I'm all ready, so I'm gonna rock a little braid. Throw it back there, got my little face framing. I have some earrings on. This little jewelry, hey Claire collection earrings. Sweater, leggings, and everything is all cooked so quick. So Chris is finishing up the guacamole right now. We're gonna head over to his mom's house and we're taking Yuna. <laughs> oh, look at the happy tail, look at it. So happy. Happy, happy, happy tail. It's guacking, and I'm gonna show you guys the chicken, which has been foiled. And as you can see, there's the cooking mess of it all. But there it is. Trying to keep the heat in, obviously. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Don't worry about me. I'm over here just <laughs> filming my cards. We're playing Bonanza with Jackson, Danielle, uh, Chris, and bean. Rachel. And that's really all I'm willing to do. Rachel, like, <laughs> she there. Now, you can get that. To I didn't Danielle have my camera. For free. I left it at Chris's mom's and house yesterday. Give her I'll do black the trash pile for a second. Yeah. No, you ain't allowed to look through the trash pile. <laughs> You're she not allowed. You can't. You can't count. You can't count what's in there. <laughs> Yeah, we're at Chris's aunt's house and it's Thanksgiving, so, so it's the first clip we got to see. Right, take two and then put two back in the pile. And everyone's getting a hang of the game one. now, so. Four equals one. I'm about to say, I don't know if you want to do that because I do have Y'all missed out on all the food pictures it's and all that. It's not going to do much for me. Okay. I mean, I'm I mean, you could take them up. Hey, look. 